What's up guys and welcome to today's tutorial on the do while loop. So carrying on from the last tutorial's while loop, what we're gonna do is change it to a do while loop. So first, I want you to move this part of code to the end of it and just put a semicolon at the end and then add do before the opening brackets. This is all, that's it for a do while loop. So what this is saying is run this piece of code, then check this condition so this will always run at least once. So because that's the case, we can get rid of this. And you can see it's not complaining that this user's guess isn't initialized because it gets initialized inside the do while loop. So if we run this, let's see what happens. So you're saying, so this is the first running of this part. So let's guess a number wrong. So one. So as long as I guess wrong, this is equal to true and this loop will keep happening. So that's so if I enter two, still gonna keep happening. And if I enter seven, then this part here evaluates to false and the loop finishes and it tells us that we got the correct answer. And so that's it for our loop tutorials. Uh, but in the next tutorial, we're gonna go over combining loops and if statements. If you're liking this series and you wanna see more, please like and subscribe.